And we're very happy to have with us Coelho Deer and Simon Savien from a fabulous new play called Saint Jude du Village, which is the French adaptation of Holy Trinity, uh, a play that has had a lot of success, a play uh, that uh, you may have seen at that Fringe. Welcome to the show, first of all, both of you. Thank you. Thank you for waking up this early for both of us. You're welcome. <laughs> we'll start with you, Paula. Tell us a little bit about what this play is about and, and the French adaptation uh, is all about. I don't know. Before I start with that, there's a monitor over there. I need to go on a diet. No. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> That's ridiculous. No. This play is about... <laughs> <laughs> all right. Proceed. Jude, a 17-year-old runaway. It's a coming of rage story. Coming of rage, not coming of age. Coming, coming of, rage, of rage, which means what? Well, in the 80s, you know, the gay community was dealing with the AIDS crisis. It was the beginning of the AIDS crisis for many of us. And it was also a moment in time where the community was starting to take their rights into their own hands. And so there was a lot of rage uh, around our, our health not being taken care of by the Reagan government, by, at that time, the Mulroney government. And so, you know, you had these protest groups, ACT UP, Queer Nation, that started to come up uh, at that time. And they were full of rage. And so this is the story of a young man. So I mean, tell me about uh, tell me about who is the main character and why will people love him? I am not the main character. I am uh, Michael in the Holy Trinity. Michel for Saint Jude. Uh, he's an ex-military uh, bouncer at this club, and also tough guy. yeah, a tough guy, tough guy, but you know, sweetheart, who becomes an ace activist. Uh, main character is Jude, is the, the 17 year old who actually, um, you know, left home, got into this club, uh, met Gracie, this owner of this bar, who's also a transsexual, and meet this, uh, this Michael, Michel, and yeah, just becomes like familiar with all the world, the gay world, and the gay community of the uh, Montreal 80s. And so that you're transporting people back to another time. What are you hoping people will take? What's the takeaway from, from this play? The, the takeaway is hope. You know, a lot of times when there are stories of gay characters, there's someone getting murdered, they're a psycho, they're, they're in... It's dark. It's dark. Yeah. And this has a little bit of darkness. But what this, what this coming of rage story gives, I hope, is hope is hope that in, in dark times that there, there is hope and there is light. All right, the, it's happening at uh, the Place des Arts. Check it out. There's sex, there's drugs, <laughs> there's disco. There's the pitch. What else? What, there's more? the morning show pitch. There it is. There <laughs> thank it is. you, Bugs. It's all you want to see. <laughs> it's everything you want to see. All right, thank you so much for both of you. Uh, thank you for coming.